ECG tracings, the diagnostic tool that analyzes the electrical function of the heart and measure voltage, vertical measurement, versus time, horizontal measurement, can be confusing. Here are the 10 steps to follow on every ECG or EKG to correctly identify the rhythm. 1. Assess rhythm regularity. Carefully examine QRS complexes on a six-second strip to determine whether the rhythm is regular or irregular, providing insights into potential cardiac abnormalities. 2. Calculate heart rate. Count QRS complexes in a six-second strip and multiply by 10 to ascertain heart rate. 3. Locate P waves. Scrutinize lead 2, or the presence and morphology of P waves, representing atrial depolarization and aiding in the differentiation of various cardiac arrhythmias. 4. Measure PR interval. Evaluate the PR interval, the duration between the onset of the P wave and the onset of the QRS complex, to assess atrioventricular conduction and identify potential conduction abnormalities. 5. Measure QRS duration. Assess the duration and morphology of the QRS complex, reflecting ventricular depolarization and providing valuable information about the integrity of the cardiac conduction system. 6. Observe T waves. Note the morphology and relationship of T waves to QRS complexes, reflecting ventricular repolarization and aiding in the identification of ischemic abnormalities. 7. Identify ectopic beats. Recognize premature atrial, junctional, or ventricular contractions, which may disrupt the normal cardiac rhythm. 8. Determine rhythm origin. Classify the rhythm based on its origin, such as sinus, atrial, junctional, ventricular, or paste, to guide appropriate treatment strategies and interventions. 9. Identify rhythm. Correlate the findings of the ECG interpretation with patient symptoms and clinical context to accurately identify the specific cardiac rhythm and guide further diagnostic and therapeutic interventions. 10. Stay current. Continuously update ECG interpretation skills through practice, education, and utilization of resources to ensure proficiency in identifying and managing various cardiac arrhythmias. By adhering to these systematic steps, healthcare providers can enhance their ability to interpret ECGs accurately, leading to improved patient outcomes and optimize cardiac care.